Hey, welcome to Cosmic Tides. We're going to see how the cosmic currents are pulling for Taurus. This is going to be your middle to the ending of April spread. Happy birthday to all the Tauruses out there. Links for my Spotify, Apple Music, and SoundCloud will be down below, as well as my email for $20 personal readings. Due to a high volume of requests, I need at least two, three days to get them done after transactions, so I appreciate you for your patience. Also, go check out my spiritual store on Etsy. Link is going to be down below. And definitely go check that out because we just added a new item to the shop. And I'm going to talk about that more in the ending announcements. And also make sure to go check out my new Instagram. I pull daily tarot cards. I share channeled messages, spells, talk about energy shifts. And I share updates on my YouTube channel and Etsy store. So if you guys are interested in all that, you can go follow me at CosmicTides underscore. And that information is going to be down below. And before we begin, just keep in mind that these energies can be interchangeable. So feel free to switch around the characters if you need to as we go along. So I see somebody is coming back to you. This person still wants to hold on to you. And I see this person could be sending you a lot of messages about this. And like you're kind of like ducking or avoiding this person's messages. You're getting on your chariot so you can ascend, so you can move forward, go to the next level. Because this is a situation that has died. Okay, and you're a badass being full of love, life, and possibilities. And you're just trying to be your best self. Okay, it's like this situation died and now you're having this spiritual rebirth for yourself. Okay, so I see you're continuing to move forward and this person's like wondering why you're not answering their messages, why they haven't heard back from you. Because this person's trying to take action towards you. But I see you're trying to take action towards yourself so you can enter this brand new chapter. I see you being fearless and happily pursuing your most treasured dreams. For some of you, I see you're relocating for a job. Time is fluid, so I know some airports are closed right now. But for some of you, this is something that has yet to happen. So you might be getting on a plane. You might be relocating, I'm seeing. For others, I'm just seeing this more as spiritually. You spiritually relocated, okay? You ascended. You're not in the same space spiritually as you were when you were with this person, okay? You have ascended. Your frequency has raised. And I see you guys have gained enlightenment and balance in yourself and you're very grounded in this time. And I see you're honoring the commitment to self to go down the path of the unknown so you can step into your blessing, so you can enter this brand new chapter for yourself. You guys are trying to have this commitment to your spiritual growth to keep on moving forward and that kind of puts this person in like a mental prison. Because they thought for sure you were going to take them back. And they're kind of watching you on this little sailboat go farther and farther into the sunset. They're like watching you get away from them. Because you're trying to make smart choices today to create a better tomorrow for yourself. You guys are coming out of the darkness and you're going towards the light. So things can get better, so positive changes can come in. You guys are letting go of worry and fear because you understand the truth of the situation and you trust in the universe's plan for you. Okay, you understand that this person had their time and place in your life and you're releasing them so you can move forward. You're trusting your intuition. You trust the universe's plan for you. And this person is trying to win you back. For some of you, this person feels like they could win you back if they traveled to go see you. Because again, it's like you're not like answering this person. And they're like wondering why you're not answering them. And I see this person is feeling stuck right now. They're trying to think out what they should do before they take action towards you. Because this is causing them a lot of stress. And like this person doesn't want to shoot their shot for you to shoot them down. Because that's going to cause more stress for this person. And they feel like you're being defensive, again, because, like, you're not answering this person, okay? But this person feels like maybe if they came really sweet towards you, if they apologized, um, that type of thing. It's like this person feels like if they try to get back on your good side, if they were really sweet, they feel like maybe, just maybe, you wouldn't shoot them down. Because I definitely see this person's, like, sending you a lot of messages and, like, you're not answering them, like I was seeing over here. It's like they don't know why you're not answering them. For a lot of them, this is causing a lot of stress because you have your guard up now and like before you were really sweet and giving towards them. Okay, so it's like this person fucked up and they lost that version of you. Um, yeah, I just heard you don't get the same version of me twice. Okay, so yeah, this person's not getting the same version of you twice and they don't like this new version of you. Okay, they liked when you were nice, sweet, caring, and giving. They don't like that you have your guard up now. Okay, it's causing them a lot of stress. So that's basically what I'm getting for you guys. Some signs that popped up in here. I see Cancer, Scorpio, Cancer, Virgo, Cancer, Libra, 
Cancer. Okay, so that's what I got for you guys. Make sure you check your chart. Whoever you're connecting with, go check out their chart too. Also, go check out my spiritual store on Etsy. Link is going to be down below. And definitely go check that out because me and my mom have been working really hard to make you guys some really cool space face masks. So if you like planets, if you like constellations, definitely go check them out. Off the top of my head, we have Venus, Jupiter, Earth, Saturn, some constellations. We have Gemini, Virgo, Leo, Orphicus, Pegasus, Perseus. So we have a lot to choose from to come in a pack. Link is going to be down below. Definitely go check them out. And make sure to check out my music on all major platforms and SoundCloud. And also go check out my Instagram at CosmicTides underscore. I pull daily tarot cards, channeled messages, all that good stuff. So definitely go check that out. And keep being great. I'll see you next week. Bye!